Welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, we're two former air guitar champions who are renovating this petit chateau in northwestern France. We're currently working on a room for a special VIP, our daughter. So I clearly haven't done anything in the past few weeks. So now it's time to get started. I just have a few days left to finish up this bedroom. I haven't been avoiding it. To be fair, I've been busy. This is what her room looked like when we moved in. We thought we could install the wall board by ourselves, but quickly realized we needed help. I tried my hand at taping for the first time and uh, I have to sand and see what it's going to be like. I think it'll be okay, but uh, we'll see. It's just going to take a while. I put too much of the mud on, on the top, I think, because I wasn't on a ladder when I did it. I should have been on a ladder. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll figure it out eventually, I think. So when I do a project, I like to be somewhat organized. So what I have for my uh, painting project here today, I have a bucket of water, uh, I have some PVA glue, I have some caulk, paint, uh, the world's tiniest paint stir, but that often doesn't help. We have a random bag of stuff that you never know I might need. Oh, look, another tiny paint stir. I don't need this because this is for uh, opening cans and these come in plastic now, these, these uh, containers of paint. My trusty gloves. Of course you need a cat scratcher and then I guess Lincoln left his tortilla chips in here. I think he likes to have a snack. So much of this plaster is just loose, so um, anything, anything loose like this needs to come out and be all replastered. So I'm in the middle of cleaning these shelves and I just noticed this. They're like shoe prints. They're like embedded in there. How weird is that? Maybe it's from a ghost.
I'm at a cock again. I should invest in cock. So this is her closet and this was originally a pass-through. You can see the sides uh, still have the, the moldings going through. There will be a light in here. So we sort of have to reconfigure that. And in the meantime, I'm just going to caulk everything and get this all painted. There used to be a door here as well. There's some hinges somewhere. We do not have a door. Um, they didn't save it because we can't find it. And we'll just have a, a linen curtain here. Some crazy rain. Well, it finally stopped raining and we have a little bit of sunshine coming in. My closet is finished. So we've decided to go for a little bit of a change in the closet. Uh, she wanted to do a, a green. So this is the green that we used in our bedroom. I have a lot of leftover paint. Pardon the interruption, but if you're enjoying this video, please don't forget to subscribe and press the like button. It helps our small channel grow and you'll see our renovations, cute animals, garden porn, and sometimes we even leave the chateau and go somewhere. Now back to the video. At any given moment, we have at least a dozen things that need doing all at the same time. But we had to get this one very important and exciting job done. I don't think this is going to be big enough. So which is the long? <laughs> That'll do it sideways, right? Can't see it straight right. this way. I think if we if we put it over this way, yeah. the ends aren't going to hit the bottom. Okay, so it should go this way. Right.
The windows in this room desperately need some TLC, and for some reason, these seem to be the worst out of all of the windows in the entire chateau. <laughs> So we're really not sure if we're going to be able to get the shutters off of the window. There might not be enough room. I think they built it in and they added the trim piece. So I don't think these shutters come off because we've had an issue with a couple of other windows in, in the chateau. If the shutters don't come off, then I can't get the windows off. Right. So I think we have to putty with the windows in place. That's not the ideal situation, but it is what it is. So you're the you're the putty man. Right. Um, Our friend showed me how to do it. Yeah. Sort of taught me, and he even gave me his old. Putty he knife. he gifted you his he bought, his. He had bought a new one. His so. old knife, his old putty knife. You basically, so. you know, you, anything that's that's loose has to come out. Right. Because some of it looks. Bad, but if it's in there tight, you probably break the glass trying to get it out. Well, and I was noticing the this is this is original glass because if you sort of look on the angle here, you see the bubbles mm -hmm. in the um, in yeah. the glass. It's really pretty incredible. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe. And if you have something to say, leave us a comment.